Hey everyone, my luxury stories here. Welcome back to my channel. As you can see from today's video title, I will be discussing what fits and what are the pros and cons of owning the pochette accessoire. Um, I've gone into a little bit of detail in uh, one of my other videos uh, where I talk about the increases, the price increases from 2021. And I discussed how um, I was not looking for this bag. <laughs> I might sound unthankful, but I was genuinely not looking for this bag. I had bought this bag for my mom um, to give to her as a present on her birthday. And I had ordered it online through a sales associate. And um, yeah, it got to my doorstep. I had a look at it. It was a lovely, perfect, immaculate piece made in France. Couldn't have asked for more. And I put it in my closet. And it stayed in my closet for a good um, six months. Yeah, so I was like, I said, not looking for it. So what made me take it out and start using it? So um, I went to give my mom something which she could carry in the evening out for dinners, you know, um, hold her basics like her cell phone, you know, a comb, maybe like some cash, and that's about it. So this is, of course, the perfect size to do that. And um, I thought to myself, okay, why not just get her something that's slightly bigger and slightly that is more fancier, like dressier. So I thought of then the Felici, the Felici chain, as we all know, it's like beautiful, it's bling, it adds that extra touch. So I said, okay, I could get her that and maybe check this one for myself. If I like it, okay, otherwise I'll just, you know, sell it off or give it to my mom, whatever. So I pulled it out of the closet and the first thing I did was, was that I sprayed the shadow on this. Um, so I sprayed the entire thing and um, I ordered an organizer for this before I had started using it because I wanted it to, you know, uh, retain its shape. I know these are extremely difficult to get a hand of, um, to get, you know, your hands on and um, plus their prices. Oh my God, this has gone above like a thousand Singapore dollars and you guys, I paid like only 800 so i don't want it to lose its shape right so i ordered an organizer for this and now whenever i have it stuffed in like I mean, if it's sitting in my closet then it's sitting with the organizer and of course i put the strap in so that you know it retains its shape and stuff so yeah fast forward six months i bought it out of my closet i sprayed the vachetta and i said okay i'll just try and put this to my use and like if i don't like it okay and if i do like it then might as well you know um keep using it so i stuffed it with the organizer and i remember it was my first it was my trip down to the hospital with my son i had to get him vaccinated and i said okay i have like a big stroller with me and i have like his baby bag and you know why not just slip in a few of my things in here and then take this and like see how we feel about it though a disclaimer i do am not a fan of small bags right i don't prefer the size to be very honest i prefer a smaller size and for me a small is like a mini push like a pochette m pochette matisse is what i call small in my <laughs> bag language you know so for this is like a mini so because i was already like in doubt i said okay i'm not sure if i'm gonna be using it or not um let's just give it a shot right not like i have to keep it but because it's there so i mean let's just try it and um, so I pulled out the organizer because I don't use it with that. I, I like to use the bag itself when I do have them. I kind of refrain from the organizer unless I'm just stuffing the bag and keeping it. So yeah, I said, okay, what are the basics that I want to carry with me? So the first thing I pop in is like my hand sanitizer, of course, my ear pods. Um, and of course I could fit this in as well. The mini pochette fits in here beautifully, right? So you can see the entire mini pochette is in there. And, um, okay, so yeah, there's that set. And because um, when I downsize to smaller um, compact wallets, I for some reason can't just hold, like I can't carry one. I feel like I have a few extra cards and um i don't buy like the smaller smaller wallets um i i go for like more of like a card holder kind of a thing because i really enjoy those like um 
um, you know, like the YSL card holder or like the classic Chanel card holder. So the Louis Vuitton one that I have here is like a first um, proper, like small zippy like purse that I have. Um, but then again, I try not to overload this one. So this one has like my basics, like my ID, a few of my like, you know, debit and credit cards. And then the clay here I've used for like my extra cards, like my, you know, pharmacy card or like my, you know, Sephora card or like my reward cards, right? So these are usually in my handbags. If I have to carry both, I carry them together because I would tend to forget if um, I had a really like compact, um, you know, size wallet slash card holder, what do you want to call it? I would tend to forget a few cards. So I've started keeping two things so that I can have all my cards on me all the time. But then of course, if I'm carrying this, I can't carry both. So right now, because the main stuff is in here, this is something I would just pop in. So this I can fit in very beautifully. It gets a little stuffy, but I mean, if you have your phone in your pocket, then you're good. My phone would not fit in there because I have an iPhone Pro Max and I'm filming with that right now, so I can't pop it in. But anyway, I can't fit it, fit, fit it in anyway. It just gets too heavy, right? So I'm just gonna beautifully try and fit all of these. Yeah, so there we go. So on my first time out, you guys, this is how I carried it. And um, right now it seems a little bulky, but you know, it settles down. When you wear it over your arm, it does settle down. And I was like, wow, like I would have never thought of buying this if it were like in front of me. And um, because I've had a chance to try it, I just love it because it has fit all of the, like the, the most essential of things I would need when I'm out. Of course, there are far more things I carry in my handbag every day. And I'll be honest, I feel a little incomplete when I go without like half of them. So for this is like an absolute necessity if there is too much stuff on me already that I feel okay I don't want to carry a heavy bag even if it's a small bag I just don't want to carry that extra load. You see how everything just fits in beautifully and right now this is a bigger hand sanitizer that I have I usually carry a smaller Bath and Body Works one so um, that just like fits in like a glove and yeah in fact sometimes I don't even need my earpods right if I'm out so I could go without these. Right. And you see how it just fits everything beautifully without me having to like, you know, sit down and like dissect my entire mini pochette that, okay, uh, do I want to take my ear eye drop? Do I want to take my comb? Do I want to take like my bandages? Do I want to take my hair ties? I don't like doing that, right? That's something I'm a, like a no, no. So when I do go out in the evenings, if I'm carrying like a, like a evening dinner kind of a, you know, bag, not that I have too many. But like if it's a smaller, like a too mini, like a clutch like kind of a thing. So I do kind of have an issue because I, I just can't, you know, rattle my brain around dissecting what I need and what I don't need. For me, my entire mini pushette just needs to be there so that I know all my important stuff that I need is in here at that point in time. And um, yeah, so this is why you guys, I love it. You just saw how it that fit. Now, I just wanted to show, this is what I carry, by the way, on my everyday kind of a thing, but I wanted to show you what fits in otherwise as well. If, you know, someone not like me, they don't carry their mini pochette, right? They might just throw in a couple of things which they, um, you know, need every day and just call it a day. But, okay, let's say if I'm not carrying that, what else can I carry? So I can carry my extra cards with me. I can carry my ear pods with me. I even got my sunglasses, you guys, to show you. If they're in a soft case like this, and I have the bigger sunglasses, I don't carry them nowadays. This is just for the sake of the video because I don't wear them with my mask. So they're a bigger size. These are my Tom Fords, and they are a big size. So you guys can see that if they are in a soft pouch, I can easily just put this and be done. I can just zip it up nicely, and we're good to go. It's, I mean, that's how much, it looks so small, but I mean, there's so much space, you guys, that it's kind of just a little, um, you know, shocking that how things fit in. And just for the sake of the video, I have a small water bottle with me. So I'm going to try and show you how that even fits. Right. So let's say someone wants to carry water. They're out. 
put all the rest of the stuff inside. And I can put my zippy coin purse in here as well. I can put in my, you know, clay as well. It's a little, I'll have to tug a little bit, but I think I can manage to stuff them all in nicely. So that's there. That's in here. No, it's gonna get tight, but sorry. So we'll get rid of the zippy coin purse because not everybody carries a zippy coin purse to, let's say this is a card holder, right? A simple card holder or this clay. You have your water bottle. You can throw in a bunch of keys. Of course, your cell phone fits. My phone fits in there like a glove. And you are good to go. So, um, I honestly can't think of any con for this bag, right? Um, I've tried to rattle my brain around it. There's nothing. I mean, of course, the bigger the size, the better it is. But that's definitely not a con for me. I, um... I'm really impressed by how much this bag can fit. I mean, of course, it's a mini size, right? Like, once it's on your arm, I forget at times I even have it there because it's, of course, so lightweight as well. But um, it's so versatile, you guys. Like, you could just change up the strap, you know, add a longer strap, add a fleecy chain, make it a little more fancy if you want to do so. I don't want to do that. I like using it in my everyday kind of casual day-to-day -day stuff. And, um, oh, wow. See, I mean, your sunglasses could also fit, by the way water bottle so yeah there we go so for me um yeah I'm, I'm i was like so impressed and the first time i took it out i was like wow okay i know now why the world is crazy behind the pochette accessoire why it's difficult to get and why there'd be a number of price increases so definitely get your hands on this talk to your sales associate keep stocking online i do I don't think I'm going to get the Zor print um, because I'm not a fan of it, to be honest. But if it does pop up, I might rethink my decision because these are really nice to even, you know, give down to your daughter. My daughter is five right now, so hopefully once she's 10, she could carry these, um, you know, smaller, you know, designer bags without too much going on and be like, you know, the perfect fit for her as well. So I've, that's also one reason why I've kept it like this so that I could pass it down to her. And yeah, like I said, that's one reason why I might even pick up the Zor print if I do see it come up online. I'm not gonna make an effort for it, but yeah, we'll see. But yeah, I just wanted to do a really short video to you guys to tell everybody about this bag. I know the whole world knows about it. Everyone's like, you know, trying to get one. Um, I highly, highly recommend it. Um, when I use my handbags, I try and like, you know think about every pro and con that there could be um trust me there's no con i have it, it the, the, you know you guys know about louis vuitton zippers they're like smooth as butter you know and um let me just quickly give you a demonstration if there's even your you know organizers or you ran inside so if let's say you want to just go out you know the quick errand down outside and just throw in your card holder. We all need to carry sanitizers nowadays. You know, you could carry your water bottle in here as well with an organizer. Just by the way, it will be a snuggy fit, but I mean, okay. Here, just run out with your bare essentials, you know, out the door. And um, yeah, like there's so much more I can fit. I could fit this. Let me try. I'm not sure if the mini pochette would fit. It would fit, but I don't think you could fit more. Yeah, then you. Unless you have a pretty smaller um, sanitizer and then you want to hand hold your phone. So you would be okay with that as well. But um, so many options you can play around with, right? If you're, of course, carrying smaller stuff. Um, yeah. So I hope you guys liked today's video. Please subscribe for more luxury-related um, content. And I'll see you in my next one. Bye.